Hey, welcome to channel. In today's video, I am gonna show you how to find the fastest DNS server in the world and how to choose the right one for you in quick and easy way. No more blah blah, let's dig in. Well guys, without DNS, the internet would not exist. If I go deep and try to explain, it will take a lot of time. So to make this video short, I just want to give you a brief introduction about it. The DNS or domain name system maps the human readable alphabetic name of websites such as radachip.com to the machine readable numeric string IP address. Something like this. You can see the set of four numbers separated by periods. Remember that IP address is allocated by IANA, Internet Assigned Number Authority. Now let's come to the point. Sometimes the DNS provided by our ISP fail to function properly. And our browsing speed slow down dramatically. Even sometimes we can't access some websites. So using third party DNS may help us to improve browsing speed and security. It is very difficult to find the right and fastest DNS in our area. But luckily there is a handy tool which help us to get rid of such hassle and it is totally free and portable and this is DNS jumper. You can type the DNS jumper on Google and go for official site called Sodom or you can download it from the link in the description. After download, we have to extract it and launch the application by double clicking the application. Now we can select the network adapter. If you don't know what's your adapter, then you can choose all network adapter. Now click the fastest DNS and you can see here, these are the list of top DNS servers in the world. If you have any extra DNS, you can edit here to check the speed. But the performance of this DNS may differ. I mean speed of the DNS does matter by distance of server and places. Some DNS are good for some location and some are not. So let's check it by clicking start DNS test. Now you can see this software will automatically sort fastest DNS orderly. The fastest one to the top. You can see in my area Cloudflare DNS is faster with less response time than Google public DNS. Now I can hit the apply DNS server since it automatically selected it for me or you can select it and right click to apply DNS server. Now we can close it. It will automatically set the DNS for my PC. So I simply no need to set or change the DNS manually. To confirm now let's go to control panel and click on view network status and task and go to change adapter settings and choose the adapter and right click to go for properties. Again, go to IPv4 and select it. Click on properties. Now you can see it has automatically changed my DNS to Cloudflare. Okay guys, if you like this video, please don't forget to hit the like, comment and subscribe this channel. See you in the next video. Take care.